Do you understand how a nation is destroyed by getting rid of the men, leaving the women, children, and elderly vulnerable? How does one get rid of men, you ask? Dehumanizing, degrading, stripping them of their Lack of resources, which affects the ability to provide. The violation of everything that man believes makes him a man. Final step is to rid him of the one thing that he has left, the only thing that he could depend on and build him up. His woman. woman who has felt her man's pain, held him while he licked his wounds, preparing him and being his incentive to fight another day. His woman is now getting the opportunities that he can't get and her experiences are not the same as the ones he described to her. After a while, she starts to buy into the false narrative that was created about him. So no longer does she uplift and support him because she feels if I could do it, you could do it too. She starts to measure her man by the example of other men of other nations, and she starts to resent him. Her words are used as weapons against him, and her once nurturing and caring tone is now filled with venom, and they're like punches to his gut. She no longer respects him. Now, his woman is advocating with the masses that her man is worthless. Those are daggers to his heart. He is officially alone, prey, ready to be slaughtered, and his woman is handing him over on a silver platter. What the woman doesn't understand is that she's a pawn. She's so caught up in living her best life, she doesn't realize that she is now vulnerable. The same tactics that were used to destroy her man will be used against her and she will be replaced. Look around you, the pieces are already being put in place.